Hello and thank you for joining me today at the DanvilleMortgageBlog.com. My name is Mike Miller and I'm the CEO of Capital Market Funding in Danville and the facilitator of the DanvilleMortgageBlog.com. Today, I'm lucky enough to catch up with two of this area's very best real estate agents, Dennis Simkin and Joshua Simkin England of Sotheby's Realty in Danville. Dennis Simkin is a true real estate icon with roots in the industry that go back to the very beginning of real estate in the San Ramon Valley, Dennis is known and respected by many of his peers. Everyone who meets Dennis quickly feels his genuineness and is at once comfortable. His business partner Joshua is cut from the same cloth and brings a youthful enthusiasm to their real estate practice. Always going above and beyond, the teamwork of Dennis and Joshua ensures the utmost in service, the hallmark of a Sotheby's real estate professional. Dennis, can you tell me a little bit about your background and your history in real estate? Sure. Uh, I've been in real estate for over three decades in the area. Um, I was a manager with Coldwell Banker and was with them for 10 years and I have owned my own company for 24 years. Um, but actually, I let other people run the company so I can do my business, which I love, and that's real estate. Joshua, how about you? What is your history in the real estate business? I'm in my fifth year of real estate right now and came into real estate after being in online advertising and sports marketing and wish I would have never gone into those at all. <laughs> I wish I would have just gone straight to real estate. And in working with Dennis, between the two of us, we've done about 100 transactions since I've come into the business. Joshua, tell me a little bit about how the Sotheby's names helps you in your real estate business. I would say we get about 85-90% of our business from referrals, past clients, people that we know through networking and through our relationships in the community. And then the Sotheby's name has really helped us a, a ton since we've become Sotheby's in the fact that the name recognition, the brand recognition, and the fact that people see that even just that sign on the street causes people to pick up the phone and call you. And since we've become Sotheby's, I would say we've probably increased our business tenfold from where we were about a year ago. What geographic areas do you serve? What is your farm area that you work? Well, I think we work the entire East Bay completely. Um, basically the 680, 24 corridor, anywhere from Marinda and Lafayette through Walnut Creek down to Livermore, as far down from Danville and San Ramon. Um, I think our core, we live in Walnut Creek, we both live in Walnut Creek, so it's kind of like the hub of a wheel and spokes go out from there. So I'd say our farm is probably Walnut Creek, South Walnut Creek, the Alamo area. Dennis, how do you and Joshua utilize technology and the internet specifically to help you in your business? Wow, um, it's such a huge part of our business now. And actually, it's one of the very, very uh, key reasons why Josh joined me uh, almost five years ago. And Josh, maybe you could uh, get into that a little bit. Well, like I said, prior to getting into real estate, I was in online advertising, so I kind of know how advertising on the on the internet works. And we've taken that when we before we became Sotheby's and utilized it to the maximum as we could, using all the websites possible. And the previous company, United California Brokers, basically had a situation where everything on our sites in the MLS got linked on to Realtor.com and a couple of other major websites for real estate. Since then, I think. One of the things you've asked about, how does Sotheby's help us? Sotheby's has incredible web exposure. They've done tons of studies, and they spend hundreds of thousands of dollars in brand recognition and checking where people are coming from. And they figured out that 83% of people shopping for real estate look online prior to going out to a house. So because of that, we're across the websites incredibly. Um, along those lines also, I've always had access to BlackBerry, Internet connections everywhere I go. Um, I'm reachable. So usually if somebody emails me if it's a legitimate lead, I get back to them within two to five minutes. Even if it's just a, I'm in a meeting right now, I'll call you back. Sometimes it's irritating being on vacation with him because the phone, his BlackBerry is going off constantly. But he really stays in touch with people. It's, it's amazing. 